Why is it that most financial people don't make any sense at all? Check out this week's Money Minutes and find out. All right, it's your proverbial financial advisors for this week's MoneyMinutes.com. Ryan Payne, Courtney Dominguez, right here at the Brooklyn Bridge. Court, you know, I was wondering today is, you know, what do you think of the market here? Yeah, well, we do a lot of research on the markets. Yes. And I think we've been talking a lot about really where our valuations right now, which we think look very good just given where PE ratios are right now. Okay. One thing we're also watching is making sure the duration on your bond portfolio is in an uh, appropriate manner just given interest rates are rising. Courtney? I have no idea what you're talking about. You mean that wasn't simple? <laughs> it was not simple at all. <laughs> and that's the problem with our industry is yeah. people love to talk above you. Why does yes. everyone in our industry want to make this stuff so complex that you just feel confused and you have no idea what you're doing? Exactly. I yeah. would say the mainstream media is a really good culprit of that, as are most financial advisors yes, out there. people like us. They like to use these words that really are actually really simple when you get down to it, but they like to throw these over our head and just sound really smart. At the end of the day, you need to make sure you can talk to somebody who's just going to explain this in basic terms. If anything is too complicated, it's probably not worth your while. Yeah, that's right. We have an old joke here on Wall Street. Wall Street is ordinary people trying to do extraordinary things. It shouldn't be complex. It should be, it should be intuitive. You need to understand it because you need to save. If you want to get a better baseline of just understanding financial jargon, you can click on the link above or below. You can get our guide to keeping it simple just to get you started. Mm -hmm. And if you want our weekly, timely, enthralling <laughs> weekly content, you can subscribe to the link above or below, moneyminutes.com. That's this week's Money Minutes. As always, be, be bullish. bullish.